Hi there, this is Vic at Four Seasons. Today I'd like to talk to you about the care of poinsettias. No matter where you get them, when you go out shopping for poinsettias, you want to make sure of a couple of things. First of all, you want to make sure that the leaves are nice and green and they're not turning yellow and curling up and dropping off. Okay? You also want to make sure that it's got a nice bright color, whether it's a red color or pinks or whites or whatever. You want to make sure that the color looks good and it's not washed out. The other thing you want to look for is the cyathea or the actual true flowers of the poinsettia, which are here in the center of these bracts, okay? that they are not falling out and that they look healthy and happy. And that's the first step to having a healthy poinsettia when you take it out of the store. So the next thing that we want to talk about is once you get it home, what kind of light and what kind of water requirements does it, does it take? And while the days are short, i.e., you know, like December, January, into February, you want to make sure that it gets good light. It doesn't have to have necessarily high light, although um, they're in a greenhouse and they're in full sun, that you can certainly put it in full sun. It won't be a problem. You just don't want to get it real hot. Okay, so evenly warm, 70, 75 degrees is good. It can go down to about 55 degrees with no problem whatsoever. But you want to keep it in relatively good light. Now, watering goes hand in hand with that. So the more light you give it, the more water it's probably going to take. And the less light you give it, the less watering it's going to take. At my house, I have it about 8 to 10 feet away from a window. And it's just sitting on the hearth. And it's gorgeous. And it only gets watered well once a week. And that's plenty. So uh, it doesn't have to have lots of water. Don't let it sit in water, and don't let it get really, really dry. If it gets really, really dry, these lower leaves that are green right now will turn yellow and fall off, and all you'll have left is the, is the, the, the bracts on top. Or if you keep it really wet, the roots will rot and the whole plant will collapse. So you want to run it in between, not real wet and not real dry. And fertilizer is not necessary till at least March or so. And when I say fertilizer, uh, these plants will easily last if they're happy and they last at my house uh, until Thanksgiving. And we finally usually get tired of them by about St. Patrick's Day and throw them out. But um, you can certainly uh, keep them happy until then. And at that point, if you want to start fertilizing about once every couple of weeks or so, that's great. So if you have any questions about how to care for your poinsettias or you need some extra help, come in and see me or any of our staff here and we're glad to help you any way we can. Happy holidays.